Five GoPro photography ideas explained in 90 seconds. Let's go. Take some invisible tape to tape the ball to the racket and put your GoPro as close to the table as possible. Then move your racket really close to your GoPro and take every five seconds a time-lapse photo. Edit the colors in post and then 15 seconds are over. So let's move on to the next photo. Put your GoPro below any object you could stand on and make a step in the air. Take every five seconds a time-lapse photo to get the raw files. Edit your picture in post and here we go. Next photo and 30 seconds are over. Grab your selfie stick, the longest one you have, no even longer and set your GoPro once more to the time-lapse mode. Take every 5 seconds a photo, choose one you like, edit it in Lightroom and that's it. 41 seconds in and you probably ask yourself what you are gonna learn in the next 49. Well, here you go. Set your GoPro to the burst feature and jump in front of your camera to get an effect where it looks like as if you are floating in the air. For this picture I had to edit the colors pretty much to make it look more dramatic, but that didn't stop me from going once more outdoors to get for you a really nice photo a lot of vloggers could use. Mount your GoPro on your selfie stick with the other GoPro which you would use for filming, just rewind this part if that was too fast and set your Hero 9 again to the 5 seconds time lapse mode. Take your shots, select one you like, edit the colors and that's it. Would you if you like to see me live streaming how I edit my photos and videos, let me know in the comments and then I say you get the rest of the time to subscribe to my channel.